Cristiano Ronaldo, arguably the greatest player of all time, has had his fair share of custom colorways when it comes to the Nike Mercurial, thanks to his partnership with the brand. Hello guys, my name is Cam from Power and Precision, and today we are going to be counting down the top seven football boots from Cristiano Ronaldo. Let's get into the video. Kicking off the collection, we rewind to early 2016 when Cristiano Ronaldo picked up this cool limited release called the 324K Gold. It was limited to about 3,000 pairs worldwide, and these boots were inspired by one of his favourite vapour-free colourways he wore when he was younger. The boots were made to commemorate Cristiano Ronaldo breaking the club record at Real Madrid by surpassing 324 goals, becoming the all-time top scorer for Real Madrid. The boot itself is a Superfly 4, which was released ahead of the World Cup in 2014, and this was one of the first boots to receive a white upper, which I think looks really clean and really cool. My favourite feature on the boot is the glitter heel tab. When you put the flash on it or shine a light on it, it sparkles like crazy, and I just think it's something small that looks really good. Moving into 2017, we've got another limited release, and this is CR7's Quinto True Inifo football boots, which were made to celebrate him winning his fifth Ballon d'Or. The boot itself is a Superfly 5, and it features this crazy gold sole plate, which is definitely a standout feature. And inside the Nike swoosh, it also has the numbering to mark all the years where he won the Ballon d'Ors. To recite them for you, it is 2008, 2013, 2014, 2016, and 2017. A pretty cool design, which looks really cool up close. Making these boots that much more special, they're only limited to 1,000 pairs worldwide. I'm lucky enough to have pair 660 in my UK size 9, and these are definitely one of my favourite pairs of boots ever. Number 5 in the countdown might not be a CR7 release as such, but this is one of the first Mercurials that he wore and headlined back in 2008 when he played for Manchester United. I'm sure most of you guys will probably recognise and be familiar with this colourway. This is the Orange Peel Vapor 4 which featured in that famous advert where Cristiano Ronaldo raced a Bugatti Veyron and was supposedly faster. But the reason I love and remember these football boots is because this was the model he wore when he scored that outrageous free kick against Portsmouth. Take a look. Here he comes. Oh my word! Can you believe the genius of this man? What a hit! David James stood like a statue and already United are two up, both from Cristiano Ronaldo. Not only that, but the reason I've put these football boots at number five in my list is because I think this colourway is so underrated. The simple designs back in the day with one colour for the upper and one colour for the tip was all you need. And look at that carbon fibre sole plate. This was the first of its kind back in the day and these used to cost £275. That's more than most football boots nowadays. Crazy how football boots change. Fast forward almost 10 years and Cristiano Ronaldo is still headlining the Mercurial and this time he's got his own chapter series with seven football boots being released and this pair is number five. The boot is called Cut to Brilliance and it is inspired by Cristiano Ronaldo reaching the heights of his career at Real Madrid. It's supposed to remind you of a diamond when you catch it in the light you see all those different colours and that's what Nike have done by putting multicoloured fly knit underneath the upper of the skin to give you that diamond look. This football boot is a personal favourite for me because it is one of the first sock boots that Nike made to feature a white collar and a white upper. I'm a big sucker for white football boots so when these came out I had to cop them. Only weeks after these football boots released, Cristiano Ronaldo picked up FIFA's The Best Award and let's just say these superflies got a little upgrade. And when I say upgrade, I mean slap a load of chrome silver on them, make them look sparkly, because these boots are fire. As I said, CR7 won FIFA's the best award, so Nike gave the boot an upgrade by giving it a flashy chrome sole plate, pearlescent blue tick, and also silver CR7 lettering on the instep. These boots weren't that limited when it came to numbers, but you did have to pay an extra £50 to buy these compared to the standard Superfly 5. One feature that did carry over from the Chapter 5 Superfly is the text on the heel tab, which in Portuguese reads El Sueno del Nino, and I believe it translates to the boy with a dream. This represents Cristiano Ronaldo as a boy with a dream to win all these awards, play for the best teams, and be the ultimate baller that he is today. Number two in my list is one of Cristiano Ronaldo's first signature releases from Nike Football. This boot is called Love to Win, Hate to Lose, and it represents his emotions for the game. On the heel, you can find the logo, which is a love heart and a cross through it to represent the love and hate. 
but it also spells CR7 if you look closely and you can work out the lines. I'll show you a graphic on screen now so you can see it, but it's a really cool touch and one of my favourite features on this football boot. Another reason I love these is because it was the first top end football boot I've ever owned. I wore them loads because I absolutely love the colourway of them. The black, white, blue and pink sole plate with the glass fibre looks unreal and these are definitely one of my favourite CR7 boots ever. That was until these came along, the CR7 Superfly 5 Vittorious Football Boots made to celebrate Cristiano Ronaldo winning his fourth Ballon d'Or back in 2016. The boots were limited to only 777 pairs worldwide. I got them in my UK size 9 and this is the most limited pair I've got in my collection. The reason I put these at number one is because I think they look the best. A triple white upper with that flashy gold sole plate is unreal. I can't say enough good things about these football boots. For me, they're the best looking Superfly and definitely my favorite CL7 release over the years. And that is why these rank number one in my collection. And so guys, that concludes this top seven countdown of Cristiano Ronaldo football boots. Let me know in the comment section below which boot is your favorite and what you'd have put at number one if this video was yours. Thanks for watching as always. Please support this video with a like if you did enjoy it and stay subscribed because during the World Cup, we're gonna be posting so much more content with new boot releases, you don't wanna miss it. I've been Cam, these have been my Cristiano Ronaldo football boots and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.